Hey Strikers, this is SF and welcome to Striker Chains. This time it's going to be Misato, Kurasaki, uh, Kuratsugi Misato, and I'll be bringing Alien Grey and Pine as well into Mr. Gigamentis. Mr. Gigamentis. And my friend is going to be a no no. Because why not? Because there's not many other good monsters out there. So let's bring no no. For the damages. Now this team does have low HP because Alien Grey and Misato have relatively low HP. But you do have Misato's uh, recovery as to heal up those uh, damages. This might not be the best team for Gigamantis but it's a doable team for Gigamantis. As long as you keep Nono down at the bottom you should be okay for that bump combo. And also Misato's bump combo is also strong with the plasma. She's one of the very few farmable plasmas out there, so I suggest at least getting one of her. And her stats are pretty much her kit is really awesome with recovery S for the support, plasma for the damage. It's just that her strike shot is kind of iffy for now. But as you can see, plasma just wrecks. <laughs> just wrecks. Okay, next stage starting off with no no. And let's just keep on positioning no no. And if I can hit pine then that's a bonus. Good, nice. And also Misato is a pierce monster, so she can get off her recovery as really easily. And since the mini boss is gone, I'm just going to deal damage to everybody. Now she does have bad multi-targeting damage like she's only there for boss damage so you might need some guys that can clear off uh, clear off mobs in your team okay next gonna be another mini boss or turtles so let's just clear off the turtles right away and there it is the mini boss And perfect for no no. Oh, so beautiful. And pine. I just like pine because you know blast bump and all that. Always have a blast bump monster in your team. That's my verdict. Uh, just because, especially if you're farming, like if you're going for like that one clear. Like things like the Kai series, which only needs, uh, which only needs, uh, hatcher monsters or like non farmable monsters, non max luck monsters, then you can just stack four OP damaging bump combos and that'll be okay. But if you're farming and your farmable monster usually doesn't have OP bump combos in comparison to hatcher monsters, that's where your blast bumps come into play. You just have powerful bla uh, just have those blast bumps to proc those powerful bump combos, and that should be really good. And let's just go up and down. Now the big hole in this team is, of course, the boss does a lot of damage, and you have Misato, which is a non minesweeper monster or a non flight monster. So you gotta avoid the mines at all times. Especially if those mines are near your teammates, because it will deal double the damage if it blows up and deals damage to them as well. And pine for the finish. Just clear it. I don't want to sweep mines and whatever. Okay, first stage, second stage. Not bad. I'm gonna clear off that drone, mine drone, because that will stop the mines at least. Good. And then Misato for the clear. And for the recovery as well. It is a recovery S, so it's not as great as a normal recovery, but it's still good enough for a farmable in my opinion. Uh, I don't think there is a farmable that has a normal recovery bump combo, uh, recovery uh, ability. So the best you can do is a recovery S, which is good enough for me for a farmable. And just keep Nono down there. He should be in the 
uh, left side for the last stage, so that's perfect for her. If not, then I'll be really sad and it'll be on the top right. <laughs> okay, final bar starting off with Alien Grey, and there she is. And just strike shot and go crazy. Nice. And Pine strike shots and go crazy. Pine strike shot is a all no strike shot, which you've seen in Vlad. Uh, makes her a no gravity bear monster for that turn only. So I think it's really strong. Like having a no all no strike shot is really strong. It's just that her bump combo is only for support and. During her turn, she doesn't even do anything as long as you don't. Uh, if you don't hit your allies for bump combos, but uh, ability is all right because there's not a lot of mind sweepers in there and all that stuff. I shouldn't be talking about Pine that much. <laughs> this is all about Misato, but yeah, Misato's plasma is really strong, and she is one of the farm, one of the few farmable plasma monsters. If you don't count Kushinada, uh, especially in the extreme stages, there's not a lot. I don't think there is one that's in the extreme category. But uh, that's pretty much it for me. I hope you guys like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.